Your next bout on the cards is the WKBF Australian welterweight title. Ladies and gentlemen, fighting out of the red corner. He has taken this fight on short notice. He weighed in at 66 kilos even and comes to us with a record of 21 fights for 10 wins. From the Combat Fight Club, trained by master trainer Dale Richards, ladies and gentlemen, Nathan Chop Packett! Have a look to your right there, being followed, mate, aren't they? Have a look to your right there, they're being followed. They are. Nathan Chuck Packett! And his opponent for this title bout, ladies and gentlemen, fighting out of the blue corner. Weighing in at 66.7 kilos, he comes to us with a fight record of 17 wins. 17 fights for 10 wins. From Fight World, trained by Travis Benavides. Ladies and gentlemen, Brandon Barasek! Brandon Barisic! This Australian welterweight title before number five, two minute rounds, again under full tie rules. Your referee, Mr. Ben Holland. Here we are. The semi made event of the evening. We have Nathan Pickett. The man devises it. Should be a good matchup. Nathan's taking the fight on short notice, but he's always fit. And, um, you know, he's, he's just because it's a short notice doesn't mean this fight's over already either. No, that's it, mate. Anything can happen. Um, Nathan always comes out to fight, mate. He's that's always... right. And he's 110, so, you know, he's, you can obviously put them together. Definitely. Uh, Go, going up with him, he's uh, definitely, definitely always upsets. <laughs> well, tell you what the funny thing is, like, Nate's at a disadvantage, obviously, uh, but it doesn't all pain Brenda's end. You train for one guy, and all of a sudden the opponent is different. The eight week, eight week prep or game plans out the window. He's got to think of something different for Nathan now. Like he might put it, but he could get himself in trouble too. Exactly right. Well, these things can happen. It uh, definitely plays on your thoughts when you get a opponent change. Oh, for sure. Nathan's sort of coming in, nothing to lose. Oh, that's right, too. He just goes in and goes for it. Um, like well, Sam Solomon, who everyone is listening knows, told me Seconds the down. best thing to do if you're one of these boys to take the short notice fights is that you pick a fight with guys in your weight division and you train for that fight like you're in it. Yeah. So if you've got to take a... Um, Fight on short notice, you fit. And nobody won more fights on short notice than Sammy Boy. Yeah, definitely. Nathan's definitely coming out pretty strong. Yeah, it's a quick start. Awkward style. Oh, that is not a bad kick either. The thing with Nathan, you never know sort of what's coming. Yeah, it was funny. August trials came right through too. And I'll go back to Sam Solomon. If Sam had come to your gym and three punches the way he does, he'd scream. But for Sam, it worked, you know. And he won two world titles. Yeah, that's it. It just seems to work for certain people. 
<laughs> no, let's kick that ball, pick it. You know, not just talking to the guy, I'm wondering, he's having a good track here. Let's kick out a little bit, guys. Yeah, yeah, you have a look at the thick legs on Brendan now. That's going to happen. Nice leg kicks, huh? Yeah, nice corner might want to get off the right side, can get off the ring. Yeah. They're not oh. right side. Brendan, uh, sorry. Brendan's. Trying to coach him here. No. Yeah. You know, it's a big impressive win for Brendan. Guys, yeah, he's, he's strong. For that wide, he's, he's strong. Oh, yeah. Mike, big fix that boy. Good puncher, ferocious kicker. Those, those legs on him. Oh, mate, those legs, mate. The cruiser, I'd love to have them. <laughs> yeah, I think I, I'd definitely like to have some legs cruise around that. Yep. Uh, hats off to Nathan for taking that on. Oh, he, he went all right, mate. Look, he's listening to yourself and he went okay. Yeah, he's definitely looking dangerous out there. Well, he wasn't going to draw wondering, uh, Corey. But he had the right entry. He might as well just go in and go for it. Yeah, exactly you know? right. Of course, if he, if he lands something big and he gets lucky, and see, you know, it's, it's Brendan on the canvas. But look, um, Brendan looks like a boy with a good future. Yeah. Yeah, Christ, Jesus Christ, he's got thick legs of like that weight. I, yeah, I can't believe it. That, that weight division have legs like that. Yeah, I reckon. And, uh, thank you, Steph. Ladies and leave some people. gentlemen. With referee Ben Holly calling a halt to the bout in the first round. The winner of the WKBF Australian welterweight title by knockout from the blue corner, Brandon Barasek! Yes. Thank you.